Have you ever heard of a fish with a swollen, almost cartoonish mouth? What if we told you this bizarre fish has caused massive chaos in an entire country's ecosystem? Stay tuned, because today, we're diving into a strange and dangerous fish story that's been making waves in Thailand, and the shocking truth about its invasion. Imagine going fishing and reeling in a fish with a mouth so large and swollen, it looks like something out of a science fiction movie. Sounds unbelievable, right? Well, that's exactly what happened recently in Thailand when a fisherman caught a tilapia with a swollen sausage mouth. What made this fish even more intriguing was not just its appearance, but the serious ecological warning it represents. But there's more to this fish than meets the eye. Stick around as we unravel how this harmless-looking creature is wreaking havoc on an entire country's ecosystem. This strange fish? It's none other than the tilapia, a species that's already a well-known invader in many parts of the world. But this fish is more than just a nuisance. It's a symbol of an ecological disaster quietly unfolding in Thailand's waterways. While it might look like a joke with its sausage-shaped mouth, there's a deeper, more troubling reason behind its proliferation. But why does the tilapia look so strange in this particular instance? Experts believe that the swollen mouth is a prank, potentially caused by human interference, but it's no laughing matter when we look at the bigger picture. Tilapia is a highly adaptable species, one that has learned to survive in both saltwater and freshwater environments, and it's precisely this adaptability that makes it such a powerful invader. So, what's the real problem with tilapia in Thailand? It's simple. This fish is wreaking havoc on native species. In a country where aquatic resources are a vital part of the economy, tilapia's invasive presence threatens everything. The tilapia isn't just eating local fish, it's destroying entire ecosystems. From competing for food to swallowing the eggs of native species, the tilapia has no competition to stop its growth. Tilapia breeds quickly and in large numbers. Once it invades an ecosystem, its population can explode. One female can produce up to 500 young fish in a single breeding cycle. These fish grow fast, reach maturity quickly, and begin reproducing almost immediately. It's a cycle that spirals out of control. But what makes tilapia so difficult to deal with? It all comes down to its biology. Unlike most fish, tilapia can survive in both saltwater and freshwater environments. They regulate their internal salt levels using their gills, which means they're not susceptible to the environmental challenges that would typically kill most fish trying to make a similar jump. The adaptability of tilapia makes it a survivor, even in the harshest conditions. And that's why this fish is so dangerous. While most aquatic species are limited by environmental factors, tilapia has learned to thrive in almost any water. This flexibility is what allowed it to spread across 17 provinces in Thailand and threaten local ecosystems like never before. In Thailand, where fisheries are a crucial part of the economy, the tilapia invasion is more than just an ecological crisis. It's also an economic one. According to estimates, the damage caused by this invasive species has already cost the country nearly 10 billion Thai baht. That's millions of dollars lost in local fisheries, and that doesn't even account for the long-term impact on biodiversity and fishing communities. In an effort to combat this issue, the Thai government has introduced a reward program, paying people to catch tilapia in the wild. They offer 15 Thai baht for every kilogram of tilapia caught, but this alone might not be enough to curb the damage. So, what's the real reason tilapia has been able to spread unchecked across Thailand? The answer lies in the absence of natural predators. In its native habitat, the tilapia is kept in check by the African catfish, which feeds on tilapia eggs and young fish. However, in Thailand, there are no natural predators that can control tilapia populations, and that's why they've been able to multiply so rapidly. In every ecosystem, there are predators that act as nature's immune system, controlling the balance. But when invasive species enter a new habitat with no predators to stop them, it's like a virus attacking an immune system without any defense. The results can be devastating, as we're seeing with tilapia. This story is more than just about a strange-looking fish. It's about the delicate balance of nature and how every species plays a crucial role in maintaining that balance. The tilapia's invasion is a reminder of how important it is to protect our native species, which are in essence, the immune system of our ecosystems. The lesson here is clear. Without our local species, the balance is broken, 
And when invasive species like tilapia get a foothold, it's not just the ecosystem that suffers, it's the people who depend on it. Protecting biodiversity is not just an environmental issue, it's a survival issue for all of us. So, next time you see an invasive species like tilapia, remember the bigger picture. Protecting our natural habitats and species isn't just about saving wildlife, it's about preserving the delicate balance that makes life on Earth possible. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more stories about the wild world around us.